elements. Kenny Rice is in the paddock. In fact, he's been talking to a lot of drivers tonight. Uh, drivers, obviously, an important part of these races. Let's go to Kenny right now. Thank you very much, Sharon. One of the drivers I talked to just recently, Tommy Houghton, he's pleased. He said that his horse looks real good getting ready for tonight's race as he gets ready with Naughty But Nice. Naughty But Nice is in the Billy Houghton stable. That is Tommy's father. Now, rarely do you run into a family that is associated with the sport as closely as the Houghtons are with harness racing. Right now, let's meet Billy Houghton and his family. Houghton is among the most famous names in harness racing. Bill Houghton has been one of the most successful drivers in the history of harness racing and among the most respected horsemen in any kind of racing. Bill Houghton is now 61 and though he drives less than he used to, the stable he trains is among the largest and most successful. He's a native of upstate New York, began racing at county fairs, but he began as a rider. I started riding races when I was 12 years old around those county fairs where they had the worst old horses in the world and they'd have like three harness races of three heats each, so there'd be nine heats of harness racing and then two thoroughbred races. And the purses were like $75 up to $150. But I really started and wanted to be a jockey, but <clears throat> I was too large and had no chance to be a jockey. And I groomed harness horses at the same time. And then of course, when I was 17, I started driving harness horses. And I've been with them ever since and I do enjoy it. I wouldn't want to stop. Bill's love of racing has been passed on to his family. His wife Dorothy was the daughter of a trainer. His oldest son is in horse insurance. And his three younger sons, Peter, Tommy, and Cammy, became drivers. Peter Houghton was among the most respected young drivers in the country. He'd won two Roosevelt Internationals, Kentucky Futurity, and many more major races at the time of his death in a car accident in 1980. His death was a terrible blow to his family, of course, but also to the sport, which had lost a rising young star. The year before his death, Peter had picked out a young trotter named Burgermeister prepared him for the three-year-old classics, and the summer after his death, his father Bill drove Burgermeister to victory in the Hamiltonian. Between trotters, Burgermeister, here comes Devil Hanover on the inside. Devil also trying to fight back. Burgermeister is going to win the 1980 Hamiltonian. It was an emotional moment for everybody in that last Hamiltonian at Decoin, but it was an especially poignant moment for the Houghton family. This did mean an awful lot to us. And uh, I just wish Peter could have been here because I wouldn't have been doing the drive. Peter's younger brother Tommy has also become a very successful driver. He's won a Hamiltonian at Kentucky Futurity himself and he says it's been easy. No pressure on you at all. And uh, it's a great opportunity because I get to drive such good horses. So he makes it a lot easier. Bill or Tommy or both of them compete in most of the major harness races each year, winning their share. Naughty But Nice is their candidate in tonight's race. Bill Houghton trains and Tommy will drive.